Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel project series. My name is Anil and in this video we will see that how we can check the authentications with the routing in the Laravel. So we will check the two conditions. One, if the user is no, not logged in, then he cannot access the home page list add anything. All right. And if the user is logged in, then user should not go on a login and a registration page because this is already logged in and he should not be logged in again and register again all right so now let's see that how we can do it so these are the steps of our video so first of all we will make a middleware then we will register it then we will apply it and after that we will make some logic for uh, for login and logout all right so guys keep in mind that uh, many guys are confused about the middleware that how they can use the middleware property uh, properly and uh, why they actually have to use the middleware this is a perfect example for that all right so now let's start so first of all let's clear out the command line and just make a middleware so for that I'm just going to write here PHP artisan make middleware and middleware name so let's say my middleware name is custom auth like custom and just hit the enter now you can see that a middleware, middleware is created and you will find this middleware inside the app http middleware here it is so for a moment we can check that this is working or not i am just going to put here hello from middleware all right and after the creating it we have to register it inside the kernel.php so I just want to register it in the group to middleware because uh, sometimes we just want to use the middleware on some specific path, not on all all path. So we can make a group for that. All right. So let's say moment I just want to mention it inside the web group, and here I can just register my uh, middleware. So for that you just need to change app http middleware and your middleware name so i can just make a middleware name custom auth why i uh, make the name of the custom auth because the auth is already uh, provided by the uh, laravel that's why i just use the custom auth so after doing this now let's go on a web.php and let's apply it for applying we must have to make a route with the group method and in the group method we have to use an array and in the array we can use the middleware and uh, in the middleware I can just mention the middleware name like uh, web and uh, here let's make a function and in the function I can just uh, use the arrow function oh sorry uh, anonymous function here and let's copy this all routes and we can make inside it like this so now let's see uh, we are able to see this hello from md or not because it should be come on uh, every page yeah this is working for every page you can see that all right so now uh, everything is ready so now first of all i just want to make a condition that if a user is logging then he should not come again on the user uh, the login or a register register page for example let's say i just want to log in with uh, tony and here you can see that there is a no route for go for on the login or registration but still i can go on these routes via directly putting the url like this uh, tony is already logged in but still he is able to sh see in the login user page so this is bad so how we can prevent it so now let's come inside the uh, middleware and just I'm just going to show you the echo dollar request and path and this will provide the current path to us what is our current path so now let's check are we able to see yes on a list on add on search now we can see that uh, everywhere the path here all right so let's take it inside a variable like path like this now let's make a condition if let's hide this sidebar so that we have a more space to, vis to view the screen so just write here if dollar path is 
equal equal to login and we can just make it again check if our path is equal equal to register and uh, we can make here uh, end condition all and here we can just write here and the session get sh uh, user it says session is set then it should be a redirect on home page so just return redirect on uh, root so we can just use like this yep and here I can just use a double curly braces like this so now let's check is it working or not so here you can see that uh, okay so session is not found so we have to import the session just use session like this so now you can see that if I'm just going to try on a login then it will be redirect directly on a uh, home page and let's try with the registration still it will send me on the home page so this is perfect about the login so now let's say uh, let's uh, close it close it and make open the another one incognito because uh, the session is already there but in the new incognito there is a no session all right so now if user is not logged in then he should not be have authentication to watch the home list add and search page so if we try to directly open this page the login page should be directly open alright so now let's see how we can check it so just here just make it else if and in this else if we have to just uh, simply check here if dollar path is uh, not equal to login and session is not present all right and session is not present then she should be go on uh, let me check is there any issue yep then he can redact on a login page all right like login all right so and the same thing we can also check it with the uh, registration page also so if the dot node is register then it should be go on a register page or login page only all right so now let's try to check it so if mm, session should not be set here all right so let's make it like this now let's try to access it now you can see that we are on a login page so still I am going to try on the add home any page it will directly take me on the login so if I just used here Tony and logged in here now you can see that I can access any page but I cannot go on a login page so this is a perfect example about authentication and route protect protection so you still have any kind of confusion you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel and like this video bye bye take care